try again. <laughs> <laughs> Hello again. I'm Mark Bolton. And Jody. And we're California Fine Wine. And we are coming to you from our garden here in California this week. Los Angeles. Los Angeles, yeah. You can hear the airplanes overhead. <laughs> Hopefully not too much. It doesn't disturb you. And what we have for you this week is a very exciting wine. It's a new one we've just added to our range uh, this year, 2012. And it's from Malibu Family Wine... Uh, Malibu Family Wines, sorry, Malibu Family Wines. And the winery is where, Jody? It's in the heart of the Malibu Mountains. That's right. And they have their own AVA. Yes, they do. So if you've ever seen those, uh, those shots of Malibu, maybe on two and a half men at the beach, well, right behind are the mountains, and this winery is just in the mountains behind. And uh, as Jody said, they have their own AVA. Um, this is, I'm very excited about this, it is the <clears throat> Saddle Rock Orange Muscat, okay, um, and uh, it's just 11.9% alcohol, so it's very light, very easy to drink, and this is, when we tried this a um, few months ago, it was spectacular, so I'm quite excited about pouring this today. It's very light. As you can see, it's just a divine colour, very light. Um, it's in a clear glass bottle that gives it just a tiny, tiny bit of yellow looking through the bottle. This, attract, I think, attractive label as well. Mm -hmm. It's very bold. It's absolutely beautiful on the nose. That's nice. It's like a Cabernet Sauvignon, sorry, a Sauvignon Blanc with all orange the, blossoms in it. Yeah, with, with orange blossom in there as well. Mm. It's really beautiful. This is an orange muscat, which is an unusual grape in California. As you know, most of the, uh, most of the grape varietals, uh, particularly in the central and southern areas of, of California, tend to be uh, Sauvignon Blanc and Chardonnay. So th this, is a, this is a bit of a departure, but this wine is spectacular. Mm. Mm. This is not a wine to spit out. It is beautiful. Um, there's some residual sugar in there, however it's far from cloying, it's far from sweet, it's not a Riesling-like sweetness, yeah. um, though it does have Riesling qualities about it in terms of the, the, the sugar acid balance. There's lots and lots of fruit and it's really complex, there's the orange blossom in there, there's apple. A little pear. Yeah, a little pear there as well. It'll go great with Indian food, which we're having tonight, so we're taking the bottle with. Mm. Mm. Yeah, it's a, it is a, it is a semi-aromatic wine. It'd be extremely good with, uh, in fact, I would pair this probably with, with Thai or even possibly Chinese, but certainly Thai or Vietnamese food would work. This would just work so, so mm -hmm. well. Um, this is one of my personal favorites. This is probably my, one of my standout whites of this of 2012. And we were very excited to bring this into our range. I would highly commend trying a case of this, particularly for the summer trade um, and selling it effectively out to the customers. And, and I think you'll see it fly out of the, off the shelves or out of the glass. And, and indeed, the screw top would be great by the glass as well. It's a really beautiful, beautiful mm. wine. It's one of the one of our best. Yep. I'm very proud of this. Mm -hmm. 